it's Gabby and today we are going to play with the ColourPop Nude Mood Palette. Now this palette looks like this. It has uh, one, two, three, four matte colors. It looks like, oh no, that's not Super Shock. And it has one, two, three shimmers. And I do think these are Super Shock formula. Yeah, I believe they're Super Shark form. Super Shark, Super Shark, Super Shock formula. I'm excited because we are also going to be applying these with the brushes. The holding bag for the brush set looks like this. It says ColourPop. It's a nice like blush color and it's like faux leather. Really like it. It's very sleek, very cute, girly. This is the brush set. It comes with a bunch of different brushes. I really, really like that. I feel like if you want a starter kit, this could be a really good investment. It wasn't that expensive either. These brushes, the bristles are nice and soft. I love this for me. I'm going to take the F21 angled brush from ColourPop and I am taking the Enchanted Mirror Disney Designer Collection blush and it is the Belle. And it's this pretty little pink. Now I'm going to take the E16 Large Blending Taper Brush. I'm going to dip into this matte color in the Nude Mood palette. It's called En Natural. I'm going to do a little bit to contour my nose. Now I'm going to take the E15 Deluxe Blending Brush and I'm going to and I'm going to dip that into Flexitarian, my favorite Super Shock highlighter. I'm going to take the E16 Large Tapered Blending Brush and dipping that into Bare to Wear. I think this brush is better as a nose contour brush because of how it's flattened like this. You see that? So I'm going to take the E15 blending brush and I am going to go in to A Naturel, which is this color right here. I'm really focusing just on like this outer third of my eye with that color, not really taking it in all the way to the inner corner. Just kind of stopping like kind of in the middle. I'm going to take the E18, which is this small dome brush. I'm going to take this color, which is called Put On Hers. I'm taking the E17 Detailed Blending Brush and dipping my brush into Moody. I'm taking E21, which is the rounded pencil brush, and I am dipping into En Natural and putting that on the bottom lash line. Now I'm taking the E20 micro shader brush, and I am going to dip into Wink Wink. I'm going to pop that into my inner corner. I'm going to take the cream gel liner in the shade Honeymoon and put that in my waterline. I'm 
I'm gonna take the ColourPop liquid liner in the shade numero uno. All right, and there you have it. That is the finished look. Now, I don't know if it's me or the fact that I'm just using these brushes for the first time that they didn't work well, but I feel like like overall, it's a good look, right? Mainly because the lashes cover the look, but let me know what you think of this copper nude look. Have you played with the nude mood palette before? What do you love about it? What do you hate about it? I hate that the super shock shadow has so much fallout. Like it's all over my face. I can't even brush it off. But I love that it has a lot of mattes in it. Like this video if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe. You're already here so you might as well subscribe. It's 110% free. Alright you guys, I'm Yari, you're awesome, and I will see you later. Bye!